Hi everyone, Dev Violet here. So today we are here in a different angle, in a different place. Because today I'm gonna start something that I've always wanted, but I was like always really scared and uncertain if I really want it. Um, and you know, you read the title. <laughs> we're gonna do, we're gonna enlarge my earlobe so I can get uh, tunnels and uh, you know, <laughs> all that jazz. I'm scared. I'm a bit scared. <laughs> I'm just gonna tie my hair back so that we can see everything properly. Um, so I'm gonna do only one, um, you know, enlarge just one, one, one of my ears. And it's gonna be this one. And I'm gonna try and see if I like just one ear. It's gonna be probably gonna be a little bit weird, maybe. I don't know. Would you? I don't know. Do you guys think it would look good? I hope so. <laughs> so, anyways, I already have a little hole in my hair, as you can tell, like for normal standard earrings. Um, and I got a like a kit, a, a pro kit, with all the sizes that I need to get to the size that I want. So the size that I want is 10 millimeters. I'm gonna put a scale here. Uh, to the size that I am currently and the size that I want to go. Um, the kit that I bought actually goes up to 12 millimeters, which is this size. Um, and I, I don't know, I don't know if I want to reach this size, uh, but my goal is definitely 10 millimeters. After that, I don't know if I want to go up to the larger one. This one seems like really big already so I don't know I think I'm gonna go up to the 10 millimeters anyways enough chatting Whew, I'm very nervous so by the way I'm not a professional piercer I'm not a tattoo artist I'm not anything special uh, but I did uh, gather a lot of information about this and I also asked my um, tattoo artist and piercer uh, some questions to be more informed about this but yeah I'm, I'm gonna do it on my own and alone Whew. so yeah you're gonna see all process of this because I haven't seen many videos of people like with a regular earring trying to enlarge their airlobes so that's what you're gonna do so first off I'm gonna clean my hands just with the uh, with an alcohol based thingy so there's no bacteria bacteria in there so yeah really clean I'm also gonna clean my ear on the spot that I'm gonna work on just a little bit in there then I'm gonna go and get the smaller size which is actually so cute look at it it's so small <laughs> I don't know if this is the smallest one, is it? Let me compare the sizes. Yeah, definitely, this is the smallest one. Okay, so this is my the smallest size that we have. I'm also gonna disinfect this. Just gonna put it in my water, and in my water, <laughs> in my hand, and rub it along just to disinfect everything. When I received this, um, things, these, uh, how do you call this, tapers, when I got these tapers, uh, I noticed that it comes with these little bands, and I was like, what the fuck is that for? And then I searched on the internet, and it's basically to hold the tapers in, because you're gonna put lubricant in your ears and in the, in the taper, so it's basically so that they don't move. Here's the taper, here's my hole, <laughs> that sounds wrong, but anyways. So what I'm gonna use as my lubricant, I search and you can use organic oils. So I went for coconut oil, it's just like a regular virgin coconut oil, no additives, no weird stuff in there. So that's what I'm gonna use for my uh, lubricant to use on my hair. And let's get started. <laughs> okay, so I'm just gonna take a bit of my coconut oil and just rub it along the taper and also on my ear 
Now let's do it. I don't think this is as much exciting for you guys as it is for me, but I'm quite scared. Okay. Okay, so it is already bigger than right here up to this point. And so what I should do is just slowly put it in, right? Okay, so. Oh, I'm scared. Just kind of really slowly. I don't know if you guys can see. I'm gonna put a little more oil. I don't know if I'm putting enough. Oh, I'm scared. Just gonna put a lot more in there. And now I'm just gonna slowly go into my hair. Okay. It's starting to pinch a bit. Starting to pinch a bit. Okay. I gotta see if there's no blood, no weird stuff. Just leave it in there. A little bit more. Okay. It's fine up till now. Didn't go all the way through. It has to go all the way through. I don't know, but it's gonna hurt. Just a little bit more. Yep, that, that worked. <laughs> okay just I'm gonna let it sink in a little bit <laughs> this is really scary for me Jesus okay but I'm doing it I'm doing it so I'm just really going really slowly so it can get you know that my hair doesn't get irritated because I want to do it slowly I'm just gonna pull it down a little bit and just kind of pull it through a little bit more. It's going slowly, slowly. That's the, the main word when stretching ears, I guess. It's do it slowly, no pressure. Uh, let me just put my camera a little bit better. Here we go. Okay, so we have to, up to this point, I don't know if you guys can see well, but we are like this. And I think I'm gonna put a little bit more oil in there. Just so it can get better. Put a lot in the back as well. There we go, just slowly getting it in there. Oh, it still has a long way to go. <laughs> oh, it's hurting, it's hurting, it's hurting a little bit. Oof, 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 it's hurting a little bit. Okay, 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 okay. Just let it sink in. I'm just gonna hold it upwards so that the oil doesn't make it fall down. Almost there, it's not much. It is a bit, but not much. We're close. Okay, we're not close. It's a lot of it to go in still. <sighs> okay. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> okay, okay, it's fine, we're fine. Everything's fine. I don't even want to know when I get to bigger sizes. <laughs> I'm already crying. No, I'm not. I'm not crying. It's not that bad, okay? Don't get scared. I'm just a pussy. <laughs> but I'm gonna leave it like this. Now, if you can see, I'm just gonna leave it like this for a few minutes. And hopefully, when I put on the tunnel, it will be okay. It is pinching a bit, but. It's fine, it's manageable. So I'll see you in like 30 minutes or something. I just wanna make sure that my hair is ready to receive the tunnel and everything is fine. Okay guys, 30 minutes have passed and now I'm gonna try to pull all the taper in and put on uh, my little tunnel. <laughs> I'm just gonna introduce this little clip here because I don't know, it's just easier. Anyways, you like this filter because I'm I'm feeling bomb. Anyways, it's been two days, two days, okay, and I still can't put on the plug. So yeah. 
I'm gonna leave the taper. I already did a thing that I shouldn't. I used the taper as jewelry, and I'm gonna continue because I have no choice. <laughs> so I'm gonna keep on the taper for two more days, I think. And you know, just expect it to work somehow. And yeah, I'm gonna wait for a swollen to go down because it is a bit swollen and it hurts a bit when, it, when I touch it. So yeah. Hello everyone! So I'm very sorry for the editing on this video because it's gonna be messed up. But, but, look at what I got! Okay, so I just got the first plug in finally. It's been like, I don't know, uh, it's been two days or three days, I think, that I had to wear the taper as jewelry and I finally was able to do it. Oh, I'm so happy. By the way, I'm also gonna do some tips on how to put this because these plugs have, these tunnels have uh, elastic uh, bands, whole rings, I think it's the name, and well, it was quite a struggle to understand how I was gonna put that thing. My bro my uh, boyfriend, my mother tried to put it in and we couldn't do it. Uh, but thankfully we we did it. <laughs> and I'm so happy. Oh my god, it's so small but so cute. Anyways, this is it for our first episode of my journey on doing my little plugs. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. I uh, hope you guys liked this video, this messy, messy video. <laughs> but yeah, bye, stay safe everyone.